Hello, hello, my Nailaholics. How are you guys doing today? Thank you for joining me today. Um, I don't know if it's morning, noon, or night for you. Over here is about 11 o'clock at night. So thank you for spending a little bit of your day with me. If you are new, my name is Jennifer and welcome to my channel. So today, my Nailaholics, I am going to be... Um, Actually, opening this up, I received it in my mail, which is kind of awesome. I have no idea who it's from. Um, obviously, it says Glam Bag, so I'm assuming it is not nail related, but I wanted to share it with you either way. Um, as you guys know, that are my previous nail holics, I am a Taurus baby. So I finally was able to get my nails done, which I kind of like. But I'm also thinking maybe that's, you know, where this came from. So um, if you like this video, go ahead and give me thumbs up. Don't forget to comment and please subscribe and invite your friends to subscribe. Um, so obviously this is not nail related, but I did want to share it with you. So without further ado, let's get started. Okay, so first of all, it says Ipsy. Um, I want to believe Ipsy's kind of like Shein. I'm really not sure. But um, comment down below if you know what Ipsy's about, if it is kind of like Shein or not. But that's what I'm assuming. I'm assuming that. So other than um, nails, I am very passionate about makeup. Um, I love makeup. I... When I do it, I do it. I go all out. But um, I do get my face breaks in between. I've been on a, <laughs> a three-year hiatus right now. Now, um, I do get my face a break in between just because, you know, I don't want to break out or anything like that. Okay, so to start off, let's see if I can fix this in, fit this in here. Okay, so we have this, like, foam wrap. I'm going to get that out of the way. Oh, excuse me. And then we have this dropping May 2021 glam bag, quarterly limited edition. Okay, so it's like a newspaper. Very interesting. Very interesting. Huh. Okay. And then we have... Well, let me take everything out of the box and then we'll go through it. So we've got this. Ooh, the glare. We don't like glare. Hang on one second. Um, how's that going to work? Ugh. Give me one second, you guys. Okay, well, that's kind of like the best I can do. I will just avoid for putting it up. We've got this, this, okay, some scrunchies, mm -hmm. there's quite a few items in here, that's pretty interesting, I used to purchase the, um, I don't even know what, what it's called anymore. But the one where you pay, I think it's like $30 a month, $35 a month. And you also get a box of like makeup and stuff. I don't remember what it's called. I'm sorry. I do not remember what it's called. But if I do remember, I will post it for you. As far as the link for this, I'm sorry I cannot provide one for you. Because as I mentioned, um, it just kind of arrived to my mailbox, which is fine with me. Okay, so let's go ahead and start with this one. R and Co teacup. So it's peach line and kombucha detox rinse. Okay. So it's for your face. Oh no, your hair. Detox your locks. Okay. So it's a conditioning rinse to remove harsh metals, exfoliants from your hair. Ooh, I can definitely use that. I can definitely use a treatment for my hair. So it's teacup. Okay, well that. Then we have this Saints and Sinners. Oh, I like that title. Illuminator Divine Shine Holographic Serum. Oh, you know what? Let me go back to this tea one. Let's smell it. 
I like this squeezy tab. That makes it so much, oh, okay, it's sealed, which is good. Let's see if we can open the seal up. Okay, I love when things are sealed. I hate it when I have long nails because then I cannot open stuff. There we go. Let's get this going. Okay, I'll just leave it open right there a little bit. Okay, not bad. Kind of just smells like shampoo a little bit. Not bad, not bad. Okay, let's get that one back sealed. And then this one. So, where are my glasses? This one says for hair as well. Okay, so it says Brilliant Reactive Illuminator in a Holographic Treatment. Serum ideal for all hair types. Oh, interesting. So it gives it an iridescent Iridescent humidity resistant shine Okay, so this is for your hair. I've never heard of a hair illuminator Comment down below if you have I've never heard of that Okay, so this is kind of, it smells kind of fruity Let's see. I'm interested to See if we're able oh yeah we are look at this oopsie okay let's shake it let's shake it first let me shake it out of camera shake it like a polaroid picture okay let's see come on open open sesame open oh hello <laughs> Alrighty, I'm never gonna get this open. Look at that, it's sealed. I swear you guys, I I'm like that person that goes try to open the door, pushing it out when you're supposed to pull it in. Okay, here we go. I'm all fighting it to open, yet it's taped. Ay ay ay, I tell ya. I'm going to tell you a story, a true story that actually happened to me where I have my duh moments. Um, give me just a second. Let me go ahead and show this. Okay, so this just looks like a clear gel. I don't see any fancy or illuminator on it. So let's see. Let me wipe that off. It smells good, though. It smells really good, actually. Did I not shake it enough? Ooh, 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 no, 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 no. Okay, let's not make a mess here. Okay, I do. I don't see any illuminator. I don't know if they lied to us or it just hasn't been shaken enough or what. So I will let you guys know because so far I'm not satisfied with this. I do not see any illumination. And I do love me some illumination, glitter, everything that shines I love. So I'll get back to you on this one. Saints and Sinners Illuminati Divine Shine Holographic Serum. Hmm. Okay, on to the next. So we have Complex and Culture. Sonic T-Bar Facial Massager. Ooh, I like facial massagers. Relax, relax, you've got this. Oh my gosh, I think I just ordered one of these too. <gasps> but that's okay. I can have one for myself, one for my husband, because I like to do... Oh, no, 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 I did not order this for myself. It looks like a razor. What is this? Oh, okay. Does it have... Oh, it does. My hands are all slippery here. Okay, so you put batteries in here. This is for external use only on your face. Oh, come on. 
Knowing me, I'll probably end up stripping this. So give me, let me make sure I put it in correctly. That ain't happening. Hey, where's my husband? He needs to do this for me. Okay, I don't want to strip it, so I'll just leave it like that and then fix it later. So this here, Sonic Power Tool delivers modern facial massage to increase blood flow, reduce puffiness, relieve facial tension, and help tone facial, facial contours. Huh, this is pretty cute. I love the color, like a rose gold type of color. So this must, um, I don't know how it turns on. I guess if you tighten it here, it turns on. Unfortunately, I don't have any batteries to show you or else I would okay okay yeah alrighty let's leave that because I'm gonna end up breaking it it did fit in the box when I took it out now it doesn't fit anymore there we go no I'm kind of click <gasps> okay there we go there we go so if you guys did I just break it did I break it? No. Okay, so if you guys are not new to my channel, you're going to know that I always tell you that I'm really klutzy on stuff. Glitter gets all over the place. Powder gets all over the... No matter how careful I'm trying to be. It, it's just... I don't know. It just does its own thing. I don't know why. But it does. Okay, so that's this here. So, so far we have three items. Let's get these out of the way. Kit. Kitsch, kitsch. Okay. That looks like kitsch to me. <laughs> Scrunchies. Okay, so we have a total of five. So we have a thinner one. Then this one for me is thicker, as you can tell. They're really elastic y, so that's nice. Different colors. Five. Okay, cool. Then we have this here. This is Patricta. Pat Patricta? Patricta for face. Monochrome Moment Velvet Blush. Ooh. I like it some blush. I like it some blush. Let's look at this. Hopefully this video will not be too long because I know it's not now related. I don't want you guys to get bored. But as I mentioned, I just want to share this with you guys just so you can be along in my journey with me. Okay, come on. Okay, this is very well packaged. As you can see, I cannot even get it open. Oh, <laughs> wrong side. That would maybe be why. Okay, here's where you open it from. Hee <laughs> hee. <laughs> there we go. That was so much easier. <laughs> I tell you, you guys don't believe me. So let me tell you this story really quick about my, I guess you could say my nerdy things that happened to me. So one time it was a group of us, a group of friends and myself. We were going to Vegas. And we had left like about, I want to say after work. So it was about... 10 o'clock at night after we packed all our stuff and everything and it was just kind of like a spur of a moment thing which we always used to do stuff like that which was pretty awesome so that day we're driving it in that occasion um we kind of caravaned but in that car it was my really good friend um two two of our really good friends and myself and I was really tired because I had worked late that night and I was in the back seat and then um, the other two were in the front and of course the one driving. So on the drive there, because we left at night, the moon just looked beautiful. Do you know on Bruce Almighty that one scene where the moon's just all big and just beautiful and he pulls the moon with the fake rope and stuff? Okay, so that's what it looked like. It looked really, really beautiful. So I told my friend, I'm like, hey, hey, stick out, stick your head out the window and take a picture of the moon because it looks beautiful. And she's like, I'm not going to stick my head out and have a semi chop it off. I'm like, it's not going to happen to you. Just stick your head out and take a picture because I didn't want the window frame in the picture. So she's like, okay, wait till we get closer. 
I'm like, all right, sounds cool. So I'm sitting there in the back, <laughs> in the back seat, and they start laughing, and I'm like, what are you guys laughing at? I totally, it just totally went over my head. So I'm like, what are you guys laughing at? What's so funny? And she's like, wait till we get closer. Ha ha, we're never going to get closer to the moon. Okay. <laughs> so that's when I caught on, started laughing. I'm like, okay, dummy, I'm the but if you're a joke here but yeah i fall into things like that all the time i'm pretty pretty smart but for simple stuff i don't know i just don't get simple stuff sometimes but anyways that's a funny story for you okay so this is the paprika blush Ooh, look at that hello phone hello my phone okay let's go ahead and open this Ooh, look at that. Does it have a little brush? Oh, no brush. Okay. Look at how pretty this is, though. It's really velvety. Mm, let's see. Slight, slight blush color. You see it there? Put a little bit more. See it there? That is really pretty. Just a subtle, subtle <laughs> highlight of blush. I like this one. That is very pretty. Okay, does this have any number? So this, I guess that would be the number right here. T342A. I don't know where you can purchase these or what stores, but maybe online you might find it. Okay. Um, let's open this one here. So this says, okay, matte paint lip, matte paint it lip color. It says about face, made in Italy. This is the last good night is the color. Let's get this open. Chop, chop. Come on. Come on. Oh, let's push it up this way. There we go. Ah, there we go. Okay, so I do like this covering to it. It's really pretty. I wonder if this is a color. That's a very pretty shade. Okay, it's screws. Oh, it's like a gloss. There we go. Ooh. <laughs> okay, let's show you guys. There's our blush. Ooh, I like that. That is very pretty. I know I'm saying ooh and ah a lot, but these are very, very pretty. I'm excited. I can blend it out a little bit if you don't want it as dark. Ooh, I like it. I like it. Now let me take this off so I don't smear it all over the place because knowing me, I will. Okay, so that one was, what was it? What was the name of it? Last Good Night. Very pretty. I can so see myself wearing this. Okay. We're almost done. Just two more items and we will be done with this video. Let's open this. So this is Pat McGrath Labs. It says Fetish Eyes Mascara. Okay. Okay, let's see. This looks like it opens here. Mm, does it open here? Okay, let's cut this open because... So this just says mascara, da, 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 extreme black. Okay, I like black. Let's get this open. Okay, so this is the packaging. Okay, and 
and it says it's black. Let me see the wand. Okay, the wand's not bad. And let's check out the black. Okay, definitely black. It smells good, you guys. The mascara smells good. Ooh, it has like a, I don't know, like a very clean um, scent to it. So this says fetish eye, fetish eye mascara. Nice, I like it. Oh, I forgot to put this in the box. That's okay. And is there anything else in here? Oh, there is a little instruction book, I believe. Okay, so yes, Extreme Black, Pat McGrath Labs, Fetish Eye Mascara. So it just kind of tells you how to, a little bit about it and how it kind of helps you out, like to straighten your lashes over time and condition them. So cool. It not only provides color, but it provides nutrition to your lashes. I like that. Okay, last but not least, Huda Beauty. Huda Beauty Rose Gold Palette Remastered Eyeshadow Palette. Okay, let's get this one open. Okay. Don't forget for the month of May, the person who comments the most on my May videos will be receiving a surprise gift um, for the month of May just because it is my birthday month and I wanted to do that special for you guys. So the person who makes the most comments on all my videos put together, regardless whether it's to me, whether it's to another person that you're responding to, whatever the case may be. So this is Huda Beauty. Okay, let's open this. I love that color. It's so beautiful. Look at that. I love the packaging to this. This is very nice. Okay, so it has the mirror. Let's go ahead and block the mirror so you don't get a horrible glare. And this is just like a, oh, it's actually a plastic sheet to cover it. Kind of nice. And these are your colors. So this is kind of like a goldish. It says, so we have 24 karat, pink diamond, rose gold, trust fund, <laughs> Fling, Dubai, this one is Risqué, Dollface, Demure, Blessed, um, Moondust, Bubbly, and then right here we have Sandalwood, Henna, Man Eater, I'm a Man Eater, Coco, Suede, and Black Truffle. Oh, I love using black. This is really pretty. Ooh, which one is my favorite? I'm really liking this one, the pink diamond. I think that would give a very, very beautiful um, for your eyeshadow, your lid. Very nice. Okay, so I will be enjoying this soon. So that is the end for this box. Whoever just sent it to me, thank you so much. I really do appreciate it. It made my birthday extra special. So don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for joining me once again, and I will see you soon. Bye.